Half of workers would rather quit than go back to the office full time as the pandemic ramps up. That's what research from the global human resource consulting firm Robert Half is showing. So how do employers and employees find some common ground here? Thomas Vick, regional director with Robert Half, is with us this morning. Good morning. How are you? Good morning. How are you? Doing pretty good. Thanks for joining us. So, so first of all, why don't employees want to go back to the office? They've gotten very comfortable being able to work from home. They've gotten used to that at-home environment or some type of hybrid environment. And so because they are comfortable and they feel like they're extremely productive in their current environment, um, they're not real eager to go back to the office on a full-time basis. Yeah. And why do you think companies are reluctant to adopt a hybrid work model? I think a lot of companies still look at the fact that they think it's more productive to be in the office and it helps establish a better culture in their opinion. And so because of that, they are starting to push more and more workers to go back into the office. But as you said, over half the workers out there have said they'll look for a new opportunity if they're forced to go back to the office full time. Yeah. Well, how can companies benefit from embracing some sort of hybrid work model? Well, companies benefit because they help. It helps from a retention perspective with their current employees, but it also helps when it comes to attracting new employees. And obviously, this is a very tight labor market right now. And so with that in mind, allowing for some type of hybrid or fully remote type of environment, giving the employees the option of where they work can help not only be a retention tool, but also to attract new talent. Well, people are, people are already quitting at record highs. If employers yeah. don't budge on this working from the office thing, do you foresee quit rates increasing? We do. Um, and the research out there shows that, again, over half the people have said if they have to go back into the office full time, that they will look for all their opportunities. And so as more and more companies are pushing to get employees back in the office, um, some or full time, we do anticipate that's going to create this turnover cycle that's only going to continue. Thomas Vick with Robert Half, thank you so much for joining us this morning. We appreciate you. Thank you. I appreciate it.